Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at the steps to bring back the classic ribbon menu for File Explorer on Windows 11. Windows 11 introduces an updated version of File Explorer that ditches the classic ribbon style menu like the one we see in the Office apps with a simpler menu with fewer commands, as you can see right here. If you prefer the classic menu, it is still possible to bring it back, at least in the early previews of Windows 11. However, this process involves editing the registry, which is typically something not recommended to do, since making a mistake can break the installation of Windows. It is assumed that you know what you're doing and you have created a backup before proceeding. So here is how to bring back the classic reboot menu for File Explorer on Windows 11. First, open Start and look for the registry. Then, open this path. Local Machine, Software, Microsoft, Windows, Current Version, Shell Extensions, and we're going to go to the Block Key. So you don't have to pause the video, I'm going to leave a link in the video description to the written steps to complete these tasks. Then, inside of the Block Key, right click on it, go to New, and then select the Stream Value option. And for the name, use this. Then you can simply close the registry, and then restart the computer. Then when you're back into the desktop, start File Explorer and it should not appear with the classic Reboot menu. Now if you want to revert the changes, you need to follow the same steps. We're going to have to delete the key that we created. So to do that, we open Start and then go to the registry and then on the same path inside of the block key right click the string that we created and simply delete it and then restart the computer again when you're back into the desktop open file explorer and we should now have the new style menu on the application and that is all there is to it. That's how you enable and disable the classic ribbon menu on File Explorer for Windows 11. It is unclear if we're going to be able to do this once the final version of Windows 11 ships to everyone, but at least for now, if you still like the all menu and you're testing Windows 11, this is one way that you can do this. Remember to like the video, leave your comments, subscribe to the channel if you haven't done that yet, and I just hope this video was informative for you, and I would like to thank you for viewing.